All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, we are playing some Vayne on PBE because they just buff Vayne. She scales with AP now. W has a 0 0.15 ratio, so I think that means it's going to gain 1.5% for every 100 AP, hopefully. But also, that's not just it. They've changed AD items a lot. There's Static Shiv back in the game now. Kraken Slayer now does magic damage, and it does more if you proc it twice. And Rage Blade's a mythic. So, I think we're going to do... Yeah, we're definitely going to do Rage Blade first. Like, why wouldn't Vayne want a Rage Blade? I think I'm going to do Rage Blade into full AP. Does Kraken give AP? No, Kraken gets AD. But Kraken's, like, insanely good. But, yeah, we are going to do so much max health true damage. I could do the Rage Blade into... How about I do Rage Blade Nashers and go full AP? And maybe we'll get the Kraken later. Because the Kraken does magic damage on hit. But I want to do as much true damage as I can. Make it unavoidable. I think that'll be much cooler. So yeah, lots of... Lots of new... Items, lots of new builds we can do. Make sure you subscribe to my channels so you can catch all the videos. I got two of them Swag, Zareth, and TC Swag. Can I get these minions? Hello. It's Galio mid. I thought it was going to be Swain. TSing is not going as planned so far. But it's okay. We bought the call. We totally need to get all the CS. So I'm definitely going the Rage Blade first because Rage Blade now gives AP and it gives armor and magic pen and it still does the old um, every other auto true damage, whatever. The on hit. Ooh, I tumbled away from it. Well, I might as well max W if I'm going AP. Yeah, I think I'll do Rage Blade Nashers and then I might just go Death Cap. We'll see. I just want to get as much AP to make this do more and more true damage. 7%. It's already doing 7%. It's going to go up to 10. Oh my god, I thought I just... I think I just lagged. It like froze up for a second. That was weird. Well, at least everybody got in the game. PBE's been very weird. They should give her E AP scaling. Oh, it's because when I hold down shift, it doesn't let me click. I wonder what it's binded to. I didn't get that one. I'm not going to get this one either. Oh, I got it. Wait a second. Blitzcrank. Trendomir is the top laner. This is a slightly expensive build. Rage Blade's 3,200. But I have Gathering Storm. I'm going to get a lot of AP if this game goes long. I tried to E, but he got out of range. What the hell is that thing? There's a jungle yoner. Well, since I max W, I only really do damage if I hit three times. I should have probably still opted for the Q max. Because it doesn't really matter early. If he has ignite. I don't win this. We gotta run. Uh-oh. The dark. Oh god. Where's Cho? Alright, let me go buy. Should I just get boots? I can buy the Rage Knife. Let's see. 15% attack speed. Mm. I'm going to try this. Actually, I'm not going to try this, actually. I need boots to kite this guy. Like, it's going to give on-hit magic damage, but, like, Galio is an anti-magic damage champ. I don't want that. But, yeah, like, last item I may throw in a Kraken Slayer because, look, it scales 90% with AP. So, yeah, we are getting a Kraken Slayer at the end. 
It's just it doesn't give any AP, so I don't want to get it right away. I want to see what the Silver Bolts can do with the buffs without the Kraken Slayer. But Kraken Slayer is no longer a mythic. And Kraken Slayer procs faster from the Rage Blade now. So it's a little it's a little crazy now. Oh my god, my auto attacks don't do damage. Well, I didn't really gain any DPS off this base, only with my attack speed. Do 100 true damage. He doesn't have any health yet. I missed all the minions, though. Oh, do I even want to stay? I should have just bought my ult and maybe I'll end him. Oh! That was close. I had to chase him there. He had nothing else to hit me, though. Oh, God. <gasps> I don't have mana! He can't reach me! Yay! But wait. Not the cannon, please! Oh, whatever. I got XP. Izzy's not back up. We're good, we're good. Okay, I don't have enough for this. I mean, okay, 9%, 9 point, oh. That actually went up a lot for just buying a book. Huh. Cool. We're gonna do the, the, the daggers instead though, they're better. Can't wait to melt through Cho'Gath's health. It's gonna be so funny. Swain also gets a lot of health too. Oh, I just realized I'm not gonna have any sustain. What can I do for healing? Omnivamp comes from Riftmaker, which is a mythic, so I. If I wanted a Rift Maker, I couldn't get the Rage Blade, but the Rage Blade is like, it's literally too good on Vayne. 135 now. Uh, you know, I definitely could have made it over there, and now I'm gonna lose a cannon. Bro, Maokai just held this guy down for like an hour. I can't see. Got him. So my silver bolts are not really dishing out the most amount of damage right now. Okay, never mind. Maybe they are. Okay, maybe they is. The thing is, it scales like as the game goes on. The longer the game goes, the more true damage I'm going to do. Max health is terrible early. Nobody has a lot of health. Orc? Yeah, I could do Bloodthirster, but instead I'm going uh, AP. This is actually a full AD item. Bloodthirster shield's gone now. Look, it gives uh, additional AD. Oh no, I'm under turret. Oh, I'm dead as fuck. Or am I? Oh, so close. If I got one more auto off, I might may have had him. I don't know. I didn't think he'd be able to auto me there. Um. Six. Wow, wait. 37. Oh, Gathering Storm Pop, that's why. I, I think it's better to get the pickaxe in the book right now, though. The dark should fear me. This is gonna be gross. Oh yeah, maybe Yasuo and Yone might like the new Kraken Slayer, too. The, the new Kraken Slayer is absolutely busted. It is 100% getting nerfed. I guarantee you it's getting nerfed. The numbers are just way too high on it. Now these minions are beating me up. Wish we still had Ravenous Hunter. Okay, so I'm at 10% max health. 
I definitely should have max Q before W, but it's too late now. But I almost have the Rage Blade. I need more money. Wait. There's a Yoni back here. Oh, that might hit him. Oh. I might have. Oh, the potato, the bush tater. The tater tot. I'll help you with that. Yeah, Cringebo. Cringebo is also no longer mythic. That's starting to hurt him. He's dead. He has to flash. He just melts him. Oh, I got two really quick autos there. Oh, we're fed now. They change quickly is what it does now. Oh my god, we're gonna get the whole turret. This thing's not dying. I'm dying. Give me your turret. Red buff! No! Imagine if you do the true damage to the turret, it just get melted right away. Okay. Now, my damage literally doubles as soon as I buy this. Just watch. This goes from 10% to 10.5%. But also, it now applies twice as much, basically. Okay, so I'll go Nashers next. Let's do... Okay, so, so say I want to add a Blasting Wand. 11.3%. It's probably better to add this, though. I'll add the Blasting Wand for the walls. So, 11.3% max health, but now it applies every two autos, basically. Awesome, we've sold two mouse pads. Since I started recording this video, I got them for sale on my website, uh, swag.gg. I'm signing all the, the mouse pads before I send them out, so go take a look if you like anything. Okay, so, Rageblade, we build up attack speed now by autoing, but also, please die, yes. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a lot of true damage. An enemy has been slain. Oh god. Oh, why did I get slowed? My like attack speed felt slow there. I think my lethal tempo. Yeah, my lethal tempo and my rage blade dropped off. So that's gonna take some adjusting to get. Eleven point three. 11.8. It's just better to do this than that. Yeah. What dragon? I like a fire. Anything to give me more AP. So yeah, I have 100 AP. I'm getting an extra 1.5% on my W. So imagine if I had 500 AP. We get like almost 10%. What did I get, like 7.5? I don't know how to do math. I failed preschool. Play League of Legends. Trendmare keeps living with 1 HP. Oh, he's hurting me. But after that combo, he's got nothing. Probably done more true damage than physical so far. Oh yeah, I could I could throw in a Lich Bane too. Lich Bane doesn't give like a ton, but I'm I'm down to build a Lich Bane. I think. I'm just gonna keep fighting them. We're so far ahead; it doesn't matter. Okay, well that that wasn't really a fair fight, was it? Nashers? 
And I'm doing 44 on hit. And the Nashes isn't completely useless because I'm building AP also. What does she have? Oh, she went Quick Blades first. Seems like a bad first item, only 4%. Although it, it lets her Q go up, I think, permanently. Yeah. Where do I just go next? Death Cap? I think I need another AP item before I go at Death Cap. They should make Riftmaker a non mythic. That would be good. I'm AP Vane. Cosmic? Yeah, does Cosmic stack off auto attacks? Oh my god, I just killed him there. <laughs> I'm so strong. She died to the turret. He's just dead if he can't... Okay, now I'm dead. I should have ulted when I tumbled there, but now it's too late because I wouldn't be able to tumble again. If I would have went invis, then Triss wouldn't have hit so much on me. Um... Okay, damaging a champion. I could do cosmic. Chain's not bad actually, but cosmic gives 15 more AP. And I really want to see the true damage do its work, so I'll do the I'll do the cosmic. Why did that cut out so quick? Oh, Shiv? Shiv doesn't give AP, though. If Shiv gave AP, I definitely would. An ally has been slain. Rampage. <laughs> he missed his W. 328 true damage. Oh, he can't miss Ignite. Okay, the true damage is... Is starting to get pretty strong. Oh, why does he have that up so often? Oh, the ignites. At least I got Yone. Rylize? I don't. I don't think I can apply a Rylize. If Rylai's applied on my W, that would actually be funny. I mean, actually, I know my E would. It says damaging abilities, so even if they do physical. It would work, maybe. I'm not 100% on that one. I don't know if this game's going to go long enough to make it to death cap. I wish it was a little closer. Trinomir is just super stomping. Galio's getting kind of strong, though. He also, I don't know where his teammates are always. Poor guy. Oh, yeah. What about Sadic Shiv to clear the jungle quicker? Keep going. Yes, they took down Trendemir. Let's go. I think my... I don't know if my Q counts as a damaging spell for whatever it is. Joe already started running. He's like, oh god, Vayne's here. I'm dead. If he has ult, I'm dead. I just want to get, hit him three times. Just one. I don't even care if I die. 400 it did 500 damage there whatever the thing is with the build i'm doing cho'gath could be full build and i'm gonna kill him in like the same amount of time Well, I have the Cosmic Drive. 
And then we'll do death cap. So we'll have cosmic death cap. And then last item I'll do Kraken and just do big damage. Oh, I get so I don't feel like waiting, but yeah, I don't feel like waiting. Okay, W's doing 14% max health damage now. And it basically applies every two autos. So I kind of want red. But I have no healing. Oh, it's capped on monsters, so. There's so much I can do there. Stole the dragon. They're dead, though. I'm not going into a Swain ult. Come on, tumble in. You know you want to. He's going to turn and eat me. Damn it, it was Trist right here. The only thing I can't avoid is Trist. Actually, Trist didn't even do the damage. It was the Yasuo. Hmm. Or not the Yasuo, the Yone. Yeah, I don't have like the the sustain of regular vein builds, so I just get popped. In a 1v1 though, I beat everybody. But Yone can do a lot of damage to me, and he doesn't even have items, so that's kind of scary. Do it Rallies procs on Q. I would have went Rallies instead of Cosmic Drive if I knew. But it's too late. We have to get a death cap. I need to bump up this to like I think I might be able to get it close to 20%. We'll see. I still need to go fight Chogu. I think I could do like a thousand damage in three hits on him. Yeah, Vayne has AP scaling on her W now. They just added it today. I'll take it. At least I got her. I actually thought I wasn't going to get her. She does a lot of damage. I'll be really fast to kite uh, Galio and Cho. Okay, let's see. 14. 14.8. Wait, did it even go up? 13.8. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, it went up by almost 1%. Yeah, if I add in a Blade of the Ruined King with this, too, I'm going to be doing, like... 50% max health and three hits. So that's kind of gross. I think I'm going to go side lane. I can't really fight Trist. She's pretty strong at fighting me, but I'm pretty strong at fighting everybody else. Because Trist can just stand still and out DPS me. Because I do max health, she doesn't actually have a lot of max health. And I'm squishy, so she shreds me. <laughs> we killed each other. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> the nice thing about the Rage Blade is it lets your autos go off when you die. I take so much damage, though. You know what would have been better? An Hourglass, because I'm just getting nuked. I want to fight Cho'Gath, though. Cho'Gath's always on the... He runs away to the opposite side of the map any, anytime I go for him. Galio has 3k health, though. Void make your W stronger? Well, it does in the sense that it gives ability power, but it does true damage, so you don't need... Um, you don't need pen. Also, look. I'm getting 12% magic pen, 10% armor pen from the Rage Blade, too. Too bad it's cap. I think it's cap versus Baron, so you can't really kill Baron that fast. And there's a dust blade. You got a dust blade. Oh, I can clean up after. Let me get some farm. Cause I, I keep dying. I'm falling a little far behind. My cannon. 
coming. Oh, you're pretty slow. What does he have? Oh. Hey, thanks. Okay, at least we got him. I was a little scared he was going to somehow kill me. Yeah, an hourglass over cosmic drive would be way better this game. Oh! Oh! I'm dying! I'm dying to burn! Okay, I'm alive. I'm a liver. Swain's gonna try and W me. Come on, big boy. Oh my god. Oh, I'm dead to Trist. I may as well walk into this dude. I'd rather have Cho'Gath get the kill. I did half of his health there, I think. Unless they hit him. Fifteen point seven percent. Okay, once I have Death Cap, if I buy a Kraken Slayer after, I'm gonna actually do damage. The Kraken Slayer is gonna add so much versus everybody instead of just tanks. Well, I can't sell this. I'll just hold it till late, late. Fifteen point seven percent. Max health true damage though on this. Oh, the rage blade has to be fully stacked to apply it more often. That's why I, the last fight it didn't seem like it was because I didn't get enough autos. The problem is I have to get four autos for it to start doing that. The problem is it's hard to stack up for Yone and Triss because I die or kill them before it's even four autos, but this works. I can stack it off minions and then fight. Please be here, Cho'Gath. I want to run you down. Aw, oh, man. He gone. it only work on um yeah, it only works on champions it doesn't feel like why am i attacking so slow i'm <laughs> doing 800 true damage every two autos i almost died though did he eat me it didn't seem like it was applying them every other auto till that fight though okay i have death cap I mean, that guy died pretty... He had a thorn mail, a frozen heart. Okay, 15.7 to... 18%. Okay. Well, I could get it to 20% if I built another AP item. But I want to go Kraken Slayer, because, like... It's already overkill on tanks. And I need to be able to kill people that aren't tanks, too. But the thing I'm lacking is sustain... But the reason they added the AP ratio on Vayne is because Rage Blade is going to be Vayne's new main item. And um, they just wanted to give her a little buff, I guess. So sh Vayne will have a small amount of AP every game. The dark should fear me. But she's not going to build, like, full AP. She's kind of troll. 18.5%. Yone's dead at least. Trist is up. Where's Trist? Oh, Cho had frozen heart. That's why I was hitting him so slow too. Oh, he got me. 900. I can't reach him. No, get him, Blitz. Okay, he died. Ugh, the Trist just got me. If she hits me like twice, I just die even if I go invisible. And not out to play Trist. Especially if she waits for me to go in on Cho. But I, I do so much true damage to him. But his death recap is just all true damage. Get her trend. Avenge me. Oh, he, oh my god. He, oh my god. Here it's Duskblade now. It doesn't make you go invisible anymore. It makes you untargetable. 
Yeah, we should have did the Lich Bane over the Cosmic. I thought I'd be able to kite their team more, but it's more of just Tristana auto-attacking me to death. I tried. This gives me... Oh, oh, it doesn't give any health anymore. I thought it gave health still. This is kind of bad then. I should have went with the Lich. Oh, well. Look how much pen I get from this mythic, though. That's a lot. 15% armor, 18% magic. Yeah, we could try and Baron. I have 500 AP. Omni Vamp would be too broken with this. I'd heal so much. Uh-oh, we lost Mal. Oh, we got him. Pull him to me. Give me the Swain. 600. Oh my god, what did Blitz kill him with there? I think my true damage hit him. And then, um... My true damage hit him, and then Blitz hit him when he had 1 HP left. I'm gonna have Triss jump in. I think I'm dead still. That's the sad part. Oh my, 750 on him. I lived. I livid from it. <gasps> Cho'Gath, I'm going to die to his thorn mail because I don't have any healing. Bring him to me. He's going to eat me. I did almost 1,200 true damage in three hits. Oh my god. It's just I got silenced. I couldn't tumble. I did. I did as much true damage as he did to me with his ult in three of my autos. Swain had hourglass there. He had stopwatch. He didn't use it. He could have lived and killed him. Yeah, maybe not. Tramir is pretty strong. I just want to get this. This is going to add so much damage. Look at this. 90% AP scaling, 120% AD scaling. Yeah, I could try Yasuo and stuff with the new items. Static Shiv's really cool. Tranimir's 3k Kraken. Ballista has 4200 4, Kraken. Ballista's trying out the Prowler's Claw that's no longer a mythic. I don't know if it works on every one of her jumps. It only done 108. She maybe hasn't used it that much. Ooh, we have Ocean. I heal now. I have some sort of tiny healing. I need to get to the Kraken. I want the Kraken. I'm not killing the baby chickens. This takes too long. Legendary. Where's Cho? Come here, Cho. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, 1,200 true damage. Pew, pew, pew. Oh. No. Doesn't matter if you have armor. I do 2 billion true damage. Oh, my God. Okay, let me buy Kraken really quick. We'll get one fight with Kraken. We made it. Okay, that was finally a good fight where I was doing big, big damage. The Prowlers work. Only procs on Q. Yep, Prowlers isn't a mythic. Oh. Let me use... Galio used this on me. I don't think it reduces the true damage. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. 757 magic damage from Kraken Slayer from three hits. And it's only two hits, actually, because of the Rage Blade. The Rage Blade now works with the Kraken. You just have to stack up the Rage Blade, which is the hard part. Beware. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. Where's Triss? I can't even see Cho's health, I just know he died.
There we go. The Kraken damage was crazy there. Okay, look. Kraken did 1,500 damage that fight. 18.5% true damage. That was disgusting. I was pretty fast there at the end, too. I don't know. That's a pretty crazy change. I just did a Vayne video, too. And they're like, hey, let's buffer and let's, let's change our whole items. If you guys enjoyed... Please leave a like. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Leave a comment below. Let me know what else I can try out. There's so many changes. And check out my website, swag.gg. Get yourself a signed mouse pad. Okay. I did 67k damage. Anybody want to guess in chat how much true damage I did? <laughs> I did 34k true damage. I did more than 50% true damage. Let's go. 51% true damage vein. Here's our rune stats. Lethal Temple is up for 132. 1200 on Cut the Grass. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you again for watching. Peace.